my name is Timur. Today we're gonna talk about Steam Market. So let's get started. Alright, so firstly you should log on to your account via browser. This is the crucial part, I'm gonna explain you why later. Okay, so the basic concept of the trading in Steam Market is selling for the high price and buying for the low price. So here I'm showing you the uh, the active lots that I have. I have lots of cards, I just bought them. And here's my history of the sales that I got. Now I was starting from uh, 10 rubles. That was like uh, less than a quarter of a dollar. And now I have something about three, just in four days. Yeah, I was buying, selling, all the different stuff, including the weapons from Counter-Strike Global Offensive, uh, the fucking cars that no one needs, and etc. So, to get a profit, you need to pick an item that I want to pick. For example, it's going to be a key. But the key is not the best one, because the price on this one doesn't vary very well. So, we need to pick a different item. And probably, I'm going to pick an item from a Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Because uh, the prices in this one, they go like very, very different this time. So I'm going to choose the regular Counter-Strike Global Offensive case, the weapon case. Uh, while it loads, I'm going to explain you why should you uh, pick your browser. Well, firstly, you can update it very quickly. And secondly, you can use many useful programs. Alright, so... Currently, I'm using the Steam Trader Helper. So, what this program actually does is it buys an item that you want to buy. Here, I have four of them for the price you want, all lower. So, in this case, I have the weapon uh, case from Counter Strike, and I'm gonna buy it for 17.6 in the amount of two. And this bot's gonna buy me well, two cases this price and then I'm just gonna sell it for the highest price of a day and then that's how I get my profit so you don't have to refresh this program all the time like I'm showing you here there's no need for that it automatically shows you the price uh, searches for the lowest price and buys it the only question is how fast is your internet And also, you should never buy any items that are lower than like maybe 10 cents because you won't get any profit on this one. All right, so you type in the name of the card you want to buy, and the cards are very tricky. So here I have the Hollow from Terraria, and as you can see right here, the price varies very greatly, and this is what we're going to play on. So the price. The highest price in Russia is like 236 and the lowest is below 1. You can play in this price variety like greatly. So I'm gonna set a price at 1.8 and I'm gonna buy 9 of them. And then I'm gonna sell them for the highest price of the day. So this is pretty simple. Also, you can download like many programs that will help you to um, increase your speed in Steam Market and, and etc. Now, as you can see, my balance has changed. So that basically means that I have bought something. And I probably bought the, uh, the weapon case. Alright, so I bought it for 17.6 and I'm going to sell it for the highest price of the day. And if, I, if you want to calculate your profit, uh, you just want to go to any Steam calculator, just Google it, because it's pretty hard to calculate it in like uh, a Steam bar. So you go um, Steam cal Market Calculator, you go like the first site you want to go to, and there you type in the price that you bought for and the price you sell for. And that shows you the profit on your right side. And you pick a price that is um, good for you, that will um, do any profit that you want to do. And right now is 0.67 cents. I'm going to set a highest price. Okay. Now that I got my profit, I'm going to sell it. 
So this is basically how you do the trading. Again, you buy for a little price, then you sell for a higher price. That works either for cards, either for crates and whatever. So here you can easily say it was the highest price. And I'm going to set the highest price and get my profit very easily. I bought it for 1.6 and I'm going to get my 2.10. I think this is worth it. If you liked the video, subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions about the trading or about the video, leave them in the comments below. And as always, have a nice day.